They are known locally as the Kinnaird Bluffs, the small mountain of rock that overlooks the area of Kinnaird and South Cassegar. Currently, they are privately owned, and a small group of rock climbers are hoping to keep this backyard training ground open to the public. Kinnaird Bluffs obviously have been here forever, and <laughs> They've been owned privately, I think, now for uh, quite a number of years. And um, in the past, say, 20, there have been individuals, rock climbers specifically, who are interested in um, bringing this under our fold or making it public, public property so that we can have um, access to this amazing cliff area in perpetuity. Uh, the climbers have actually been climbing here since the 1950s. so. Uh, a lot of people would come here and train uh, to go into the mountains. The bluffs have a rich history in the area and offer up something for every age and skill level. Everything is provided from like beginner, easy access stuff that you can bring your kids to, to some of the hardest climbs in the region. So it really does offer up something for everyone. And hard to tell today just because we're seeing a little bit of um, fog and whatnot, but because a lot of these cliffs are south facing, it um, allows for uh, rock climbing kind of at least eight months of the year, you know, really, really great area. The hope is to purchase the property to ensure that it stays available to the public. I approached her and said that we were interested in turning this into a public park um, so that individuals, hikers, climbers, um, outdoor aficionados of all sorts could um, access these in perpetuity. And she seemed really keen, um, but of course the 17 acres that these cliffs are located on comes with a price tag. Super reasonable price tag, especially in this area. It's only $57,000, which, you know, it's kind of nice. Yeah. Uh, so currently myself and a number of other volunteers are in the process of putting together uh, a proposal um, and we're going to purchase these from her. Um, and uh, eventually donate them back to the city of Castlegar uh, and create a park area with it. If you would like to donate to the project or for more information, you can search Cooney Climbing on Facebook or check out the Climbers Access Society of BC's website at access-society.ca. For Go in Castlegar, I'm Jennifer Waldy.